think it's going to be uh, quite interesting to see how these um, players are going to adapt to the conditions. Um, both of them obviously coming from uh, sea level conditions and the squad also plays quite fast. So it's going to be quite nice to see how quickly these uh, top players can adapt to the conditions and play the good squash. Yeah. Oh, what a great shot from Ibrahim. The advantage here being uh, uh, played in South Africa for a number of years. So he definitely knows the conditions. And Jonti, it's also great to see um, uh, all the Egyptian entries for both the men's and the women's uh, event. Uh, it's obviously always great to measure ourselves against. Uh, um, and this being one of our bigger challenger events, it's fantastic to get all these international players coming and Both of these players trying to uh, get a feel for the court. The ball is bouncing a little bit. Good sporting there from Blessing. I think uh, both players will will probably uh, find a range as the rallies go on and, and maybe deep in the match. Um, and then I think uh, it will get more more tidy as the event goes on. It's definitely a court where your patience is tested. Um, you don't necessarily get that much um, benefit from just going short early. Yeah, this is a much better rally from Blessing, staying in front of uh, Ibrahim. Um, really making use of all the corners of the court. So let's see, let's see if he can convert this pressure. Very good, what a great shot. Yes, yes. We see a lot of the, a lot of the balls uh, going past the players, and it, that's just an indication of um, how quick this ball comes off the front wall. I think um, you're going to have to be really extra ready with your racket up and aware of, of the balls coming past to make sure you can get onto the volley. Good to uh, have a big crowd. It's good to have the international players here. Wow, fantastic oh, what nick a Great nick boast. Oh, great shot. Uh, all the way up to half past eight, nine o'clock tonight. So we're expecting to um, have the stands quite full later on in the day. So the top one seed up. is uh, one game up. Um, Ibrahim. Is, is quite a bit younger than uh, Moati, um, but clearly showing that. Um, I think with the player at the level of uh, Ibrahim, I think it's going to be very difficult to get into this game if the rallies are not going to be much longer. And I think Ibrahim is like really confident. He's he's hitting the the corners quite well, and and he doesn't look like he's going to slow down soon. Got some heavy movements there from Moati. And uh, really see what areas of the court plays plays well, and where, where you can get reward, so that you can um, start forming your strategy from that. But um, it is difficult. I think uh, you have to try and think. Ibrahim is going to become more and more aggressive in this game. I, I think he knows he's really dominating the rallies, and I think anything that's going to be short or loose is just going to be all that attack uh, from here. It's um, actually very, very hot and humid in the squash centre, so I think the players are sweating quite a lot. I know from, from uh, playing Blessing uh, a lot before in my career that he really um, sweats a lot, so I think there must be a lot of uh, sweat on the floor. But that's game, game and that's two love to Ibrahim. Yeah, it, it bodes well for Squash South Africa's future. Um, Obviously, the South African team prepping for for Worlds coming up in December in New Zealand. Uh, Jamie Hello. being part of that team with a, with a youngish team, um, and with tournaments like this popping up um, more often, um, it really bodes well for the juniors and the next level of players coming through. And if we can have uh, more of these events that our top players can play against, it will really help us develop our game and, and put our game up to that level. This is an interesting rally. Oh, that's some there great skill shown by both players and really put away into the nick by Ibrahim. Six love. Um, pops up a little bit wide off the back wall. The players are going to go for that straight nick and see if they can force that winner. I think especially a little bit later on in the game when the ball's a little Down. softer. 